Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net, and today we uh, we're gonna use the SyncToy program to backup, which is a really cool program. But first, we need to know which folder to backup and where are we gonna back it up to. In my case, I'm gonna back up my drive D into my external drive F, which I renamed to a storage backup. So um, all the information that I'm gonna back up is gonna copy it exactly the same way a mirror image which is really cool so open the program and then we're gonna create a new folder pair the left folder where you have all the information right folder your backup drive or folder we're gonna browse for it I'm going to select my storage drive D and browse for the backup and it's storage backup drive E that I renamed and then click next and it's going to give me few options which is synchronize echo or contribute synchronize is any changes you make on either folder will be copied to the other and the uh, echo any renames and deletes on the left are repeated on to the right so I prefer this option over all the three options that are there and contribute is that any information you put in that folder will be copied onto the right folder but no deletions will be made so I'm gonna go ahead and click and uh, select echo and click next I'm gonna name my backup and I'm gonna back I'm gonna name it storage backup since I already have like the storage backup already created it's not gonna give me the next or finish button so in your clay in your case click finish and then it'll take you back to the window and select your backup that you just created and then click run click run and it's creating a copy of all my information some people will say like why don't you you know just mirror your information and the problem the problem with mirroring is that you end up buying like two hard drives to mirror each other and an external hard drive to back up your mirror uh, drive so with this program you only need one hard drive the external or you know, and it will create an exact copy of your files then I'm going to show you how to use a program on startup okay now that it has completed I go to my drives to make sure that all the information I copy the same exact way. See, this is my original information and now we're gonna go to drive E and I have all the information uh, a mirror image it's a copy of all the information just like I have it backed up which is really cool So now we're gonna put the program to work on startup because uh, Windows backup system or in a scheduled backup system sometimes doesn't work because the computer might be off at the time you set it. So this we're gonna set this one on startup. So we're gonna drag the f the program to the start point at all programs and then drop it onto the startup uh, folder. And every time you turn on the computer, it'll remind you to backup. Well, thank you for watching the video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me. Thank you.